Yeah, and I think in a way, it's almost like with you being in AEW, it's almost a way to give back to the business, like giving advice to the up-and-comers and stuff like that. I wanted to ask you, because AEW has been around for about nearly five years now. We saw All In in 2018, and then AEW really be created in 2019. Jericho signed on, The Elite, Cody, Young Bucks, Kenny Omega, and, you know, what they've brought to the wrestling business, I think, has been incredible. Whatever people say good or bad about the product, it has changed the landscape. And it's given other people a chance to kind of experiment with themselves, like Dean Ambrose going in an AEW, John Moxley. I, I think almost like he's levels above where he was as Dean Ambrose. So what do you think AEW really brings to the table as far as the wrestling industry and how has it really changed the business for you? I feel like AEW is also um, uh, the fulcrum point in pro wrestling. Mm -hmm. um, they, they're they the, the linchpin of, well, I need to make more money because, I mean, I could go there. And um, if you're a young, unestablished, talent and is so top heavy at WWE that you can't get a uh, a shot in, then you got another place to go and, and take your shots and yeah. get your game up. And uh, you know, New Japan is one of those places, AAA and uh, TNA and Impact and MLW. Uh, MLW, yeah. like all of the uh, GCW has, you know, created a uh, a niche for itself, mm -hmm. and there's many other companies that are doing the same. And but AEW is the biggest of all of them. Yeah, and uh, they are uh, slowly uh, taking chunks out of uh, the evil empire, if you will. And so I, I I feel like that, you know, if from a, the Rebels, Star Wars reference, mm -hmm. AEW has done that, and they they established themselves with somebody. And I love the fact that they tailgate like sporting events. Yeah, the crowd is you know a little wilder. Mm -hmm crazier because they're allowed to be yeah um it's just fun for pro wrestling and um you know the community involvement uh is just awesome um it's, it's good to be one of the founding fathers of the community team and being able to do the stuff in the communities that we go to and serve. So like, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm really digging the fact that AEW exists. Yeah, me too. I mean, you know, when you look at like the creative side of things, you have MJF who, I mean, just phenomenal overall. Like that's the only word I could describe him as because MJF really is like the real deal. And there's been so many, you know, up and comers we've seen. I mean, Darby Allen, is kind of like the next Jeff Hardy almost and Mick Foley combined just risking his body. But you know, the body of work that these guys have done has been amazing. And from behind the scenes too, looking at the way that they, you know, uh, basically took care of Brody Lee's family, Luke Harper after his passing tremendous, you know, like AEW is not only bringing in like that good pro wrestling, that edge, like you kind of talked about with the crowd, but it's also more so, you know, it, it almost kind of feels like a family, if that makes sense. Obviously, I'm looking at outside, outside eyes, but uh, everything they did with Brody after that and during and the way that they've taken care of a lot of people, like, I really do think, like, you know, it's just more than a business. It's more than just wrestling. Yeah. It, it kind of has that family vibe to it. It, it does, it, 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 and it is like a family. Uh I mean, th there's good and the bad. There's people that they don't necessarily care about me being there, 
because they started at ROH and they feel like, no, this is us. We were here before you. We don't need your advice. There's some of those. Mm. And I'm comfortable with that. Own it. But, yeah. like, the people that I do inspire and help and work with, uh, they've done really well. And I, I'm, I don't have to beat my chest and pat myself on the back. Mm-hmm. My work speaks for itself. My vision speaks for itself. And um, it's going to continue to do that because I'm going to continue to pour uh, everything that I have into it. 